Good morning to all. Hope everyone is staying safe and healthy at your home. Children, let me discuss the last topic which we have done and I have given given certain homework related to that. The last topic was I gave certain materials and I explain you that those materials which floats on water and certain materials which sink in water. And I gave a homework to you that you will find out materials which can float in water. Do those materials float in oil or not? Now you have to check it down that things which you have taken or things which I will be giving you. Let's check it down that do they float on water and the same items do they float on oil or not? The first item which I took children that is wood. Yes, wood floats on water. Second, paper. Yes, paper also floats on water. Thermocol floats on water. Wax floats on water. Plastic floats on water. Now my next question arises over here that do these items floats on oil or not? Yes, children. The same items will float on oil because let me explain you one small example so that you will understand it very clearly. Children, if I take a beaker and in this beaker I filled certain amount of water. Clear? And I put certain drops of oil in this water. What will happen? The oil will start floating on water. Why? This is the oil. Because oil density is less than water. So children, if the things are floating on water and water is much more denser than oil, so definitely the things will float on oil also. Jab oil khudhi paani mein float kar raha hai. So the things which are floating on water, so definitely the those things will also float on oil. Why? The reason is oil density is less than water or another words can be water density is more than oil. Agar ye sara saman or materials that is wood, paper, thermocol, wax, plastic, they all float on water. So they definitely will float on oil. So yes, exactly you will copy down the same thing. That is the things which floats on oil, they will be the same answer children. Number one, wood, do it, floats on oil? Yes, wood. Second, paper? Yes, absolutely correct. Third, thermocol? Yes, absolutely correct. Fourth, same, wax. And the fifth one is plastic. So, whatever you will find which floats on water, exactly they will float on oil. Why? Because water density is more than oil or oil density is less than water. Let me cha change this word over here now. Sink in water and sink in oil. Same thing children. Let me check it down over here. Uh, list of items that sink in water and that sink in oil. So, if the things which I write, if they sink in water, definitely they will sink in oil also. So, my first material which will sink in water. Let me take the first one to be rock or rocks. 
second one let me take marble third let me take buttons uh, fourth let me take steel any item which is made up of steel and the fifth one let me take paper clips so the reason i know if the things sink in water the things will sink in oil also because oil is much denser than water let me start number 1 rock yes it will sink second marble yes it will sink third buttons yes it will also sink fourth steel yes it will also sink last paper clips yes it will paper clips are generally made up of children uh, alloy which you will study in a higher class or certain paper clips with uh, which are very cheap in cost they are made up of iron so iron which is again a metal so paper clips uh, will sink in oil so the things which sink in water definitely they will sink in oil the reason i have already told you because water is much more denser than oil much more denser than oil or you on the other hand oil is much lesser than water lesser denser than water i hope children now the things are clear to you whoever has done it's clear whoever has not done they can copy down or i'll be sending you one assignment also with this which you can copy down so this table the, these are the two tables list of items that before which i did floats in floats on water a list of items that floats on oil and the second table is list of items that sink in water and list of items that sink in oil so these are the attachments which i will send you and you will copy down in your class work copy after this children i will be left over with the last topic that is transparency opaque and translucent materials which are transparent materials which are translucent and materials which are opaque which i will complete after uh, this class that is uh, after i think on monday we will complete that topic and next week that is friday i will take a class test so children whatever topic i taught you please start preparing it for your class test i will give you a date and mention you the time also thank you children have a nice day